Hey guys, it's Raffi Gold. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a review on these Kosas. They're new wet lip oils. So these were actually sent to me by Kosas. Thank you so much to them. The PR box was so cute. It came with these little slides. Oh, I don't have them in this room, but I'll insert like a picture of everything they sent. And it came with this cute towel. It's actually over there. And it says slippery when wet. It's like super cute. But before we get into the swatches, because I mean this video isn't going to be that long, just mostly showing you guys how it works and my thoughts on it. I've never tried anything from Kosas, but the fact that it was sent to me is not going to change any of my opinions. And that's on period poop. The, these are the Kosa Wet Lip Oil Glosses. It comes in five shades. It says wet on the side, which is just cute. Um, each one retails for $27. There is, I'm sorry, I look on down a lot, but I'm looking at all the facts. Um, 0.15 ounces in each bottle. And they are actually also on Sephora's Clean at Sephora line. So, you know, it's like not made by Sephora, so it's not like their line, but it's like the section of Sephora where it's, Everything is formulated without a list of over 50 ingredients and none of it concludes, like it doesn't have more than 50 ingredients in it and none of it includes sulfates, SLS and SLES. It doesn't contain parabens, phthalates and more. Um, for the full list, you gotta look at the ingredients tab, but we ain't gonna do that right now. <laughs> um, in these lip oils, it's a hybrid lip treatment and gloss pack with peptides that plump and hydrate all while providing a juicy slick of color. The highlight ingredients are hyaluronic acid, which attracts water, locks in hydration, peptides with protect collagen, and evening primrose oil, which maintains plumpness and protects skin's environmental stressors. It's also vegan, cruelty-free, and gluten-free. So I don't know, like if, I guess if you have a gluten allergy, I didn't know you can wear makeup that has gluten in it, but I guess if it's on your lips, it's easy swallowable. So gluten-free for you guys who are allergic and vegan for all my vegans out there. Um, it's non-sticky formula, slides on soon to give you a soft, comfortable feel and slick vinyl look. Plus, it's fully wearable day or night. We gonna see right now. We gonna see. But first, thank you so much to Kosas for sending me these products. Can't wait to try them. Eek! Okay. So, it comes in five shades, which are jellyfish. That's the clear one. So, that's this one, which is... Obviously, like it, it looks like it has a tint, but it has like that tint of lip gloss where it's got to be clear. Um, and then there is Dip. It's a neutral pearly nude. And then we have, sorry, Malibu. Mm, Malibu. Malibu. It's a cool pearly pink <laughs> fruit juice, which is a neutral magenta. And then the last one is Jaws, which is a warm red. So I'm going to swatch them in that order. If I accidentally mix it up, it'll be on the screen. <laughs> but I'm just gonna put some music. You guys don't have to listen to me talk or nothing. And then I'm gonna at the end give my final ugh, and at the end give my final thoughts on how the formula works, how the shades I like. And yeah. So let's start with jellyfish.
Okay guys, so that was all the lip swatching of the Kosas Wet Lip Oils. So now for my review. So, the formula is, I have to say it's the bomb and dot com. Literally, all I have to say about 20, what year is it? 2019 has introduced me to so many good glosses in the end of 2018. End of 2018, all of 2019, glosses everywhere, everywhere. And I just wanna say, these are bomb, I love them. These are amazing. For shades, I'd, it was surprising. I didn't expect them to be this pigmented, honestly. I thought it was gonna be like a, like a dusting of red, like. But like for me, since my lips are like darker, like they're not like pink, it's harder to see when like lip glosses, lipsticks have like fully pigment. So things like this usually don't show up on me, but I'm actually really shocked like it obviously does i like all the shades except Ma Ooh. i think it was either malibu or dip i think it was malibu yeah malibu i don't really like i don't like the color on myself maybe with a brown lip liner it would look cuter though but the formula is very like i keep wanting to like rub my lips together like it's smooth it's smooth you can feel it's hydrating i know they said plumping it doesn't feel plumping because i don't like things that are plumping i have big lips already like we don't need any we don't need any more, honey. We don't. We're not going for the Kylie Jenner lip challenge, okay? Sorry, my cat's messing with my stuff. But it doesn't feel plumping to me. It just feels really hydrating. Like, it's really smooth. One thing I don't really like is the applicator because I have big lips, so I had to go in there, like, twice, which is kind of like, ugh. First world problems, but it's just, like, easier to not have to go in so many times but that was more to get like the full pigment but i feel like i have to go in twice to really like cover my full lips you guys know what i'm saying like for it to feel how it feels now like glossy but other than that i really like it i kind of like the applicator i just wish it was like fatter like if they like blew it up a little bit like there you go it would be like i would like it a little bit more but other than that, these are amazing. I actually really like them. I feel like I will get a lot of use out of them. Um, I feel like there's nothing else to really say. I like it. Looks cute. I do wish there was a brown. I feel like if there was a brown, it would have been like... But other than that, I love the shade range. I love how they give you a translucent one. And I love how they give you a red one that actually has pigment to it. Like, that's really cute. But I feel like that's all I gotta say, man. Yeah. Thank you so much to Kosas for sending me these lip oils. I can't wait to use them more often in my daily routine. And thank you guys so much for watching. Please tell me your thoughts on Kosas or any other products I should try because I'm kind of excited to see their other stuff now that I tried this and I actually really like it. Um, is there anything else I have to say? Oh, I do have one thing. Please make sure to like this video and hit the subscribe button. When you hit the subscribe button, make sure to hit that bell and push all notifications so you can be notified every single time I post and be a part of the Fake Squad. <laughs> but yeah, that's it. And make sure to watch another video after this. It'll pop up right here. Make sure to click. Thank you guys so much for watching. Peace out, Girl Scouts.